comes the, uh, the free kick. Up the heads it's towards Denton. It's a decent uh, header. It's uh, cleared the bar. I think Tony Thompson uh, always uh, had that one uh, coming. Uh, Chesterfield have um, taken the lead in a number of games uh, this season, but ha have not always uh, held on to it. Here's a chance for uh, Hancock getting an early touch in the game, working his way into the area. It's a good shot, by, very well blocked by Buchanan. In it comes from Densmore, cross, headed uh, clear. And this is uh, a promising start by uh, both sides. Good penetrating run from Josh Hancock. Long throw again. Up go the heads and uh, that was Denton. Denton is there. Uh, virtually straight at Tony Thompson. A little bit of a reaction uh, save, but uh, could easily have been more threatening. So here comes another corner kick. And Altrim getting something on there. Adara Bioyo helps it on its way. It's played back to uh, Yarni. Yanni's looking for a cropper. Is that a good ball? It is a good ball. Cropper. In fact, it's Buchanan. And it's a decent ball by Buchanan. It's come to, uh, to Denton, who's going to shepherd that out. Oh, no, he's kept it in. And this is an opportunity. It's a shot. And there's a header. Oh, is that a goal? It is a goal. It's a goal for Tom Denton. And Altrium just never got set there after Sass Davis's uh, header. And... There we have it, 1-0 to Chesterfield and Altrincham find themselves with a bit of an uphill battle early on. Well, it was a scruffy goal, Brian, it really was. It wasn't as if it was well uh, uh, fashioned, particularly Tom Denton did well to keep the ball in and play it back. Um, and then it was a, a shot that was deflected and then I think it might have been um, uh, Lawrence Maguire who headed it across uh, the goal. And uh, you said Tom Denton, I actually thought, but I may very well be wrong, uh, I thought I saw 19 Scott Bowden. And the other one was involved in the goal. Indeed. Even got the credit for it. Even got the credit <laughs> for it, yes. <laughs> Sorry, Ch Ron. Chalked him up, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Me and my mate Tom. <laughs> Here's, uh, that's a decent Ooh, shot. That is a decent uh, shot uh, coming in there from uh, Jonathan uh, Smith, former Forest Green Rovers and Luton town man, amongst many other clubs. Here comes uh, Cosolo, and he's here's Adarabio. Here's a great chance. It's a goal! Fizeo Adarabio has scored for Altrigan. Fine work by Matty Cosolo, and Altrigan have their equaliser after 29 minutes. Credit to where it's due, Brian. I did make the point. We made the point jointly, actually, I think, not so long ago that I, I don't know, but, but uh, Bayoya was perhaps showing a little bit of a lack of composure. Well, there was no shortage of composure there. Fair play to him. Kosovo did ever so well. It's a lightning break, to be fair, by Altrincham. What we'll get from Alistair Smith is a little bit more going forward. And he, you know, Malt will sit and he will go forward a little bit more. I think so. But, um, I, I, you know, he's elegance exactly the right word. Was played out here to uh, Cropper. Oh, no, oh, it's that's a really good it save. It is. That's a fine effort uh, from uh, Jordan Cropper. I've got to say, I really like the look of. I think he's been really impressive yeah. in uh, the opening 33 uh, minutes. Uh, height for sure. They've all had that uh, defensive strength and resilience. That it just shows that the the task that we're facing this division. Yeah, here comes. Uh, Oh, that's an interesting ball. Oh, 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 now that is tight. That is, is tight. A really good ball from Alistair Smith. And uh, it found... It stuck uh, away quite nicely. It was well a nice finish. Dales, yeah. It was a nice finish by uh, Dales. Confident, wasn't he? And, yeah, we can't see from here. I'm sure the... I mean, we've got stream up now uh, for, for everybody, which is great, but I take it we haven't quite reached the VAR level. We, we haven't. So we haven't and I'm afraid we haven't got replays uh, tonight. Uh, no, that would have been tight, for sure it would. Yeah, the uh, after the uh, the game on Saturday, the oh. oh, here's a chance for Bowden. He's played it out wide to uh, Cropper. Altrincham needs to be kept mindful here. It's a cross, oh. and 
Oh, that's oh. a great clearance by Billy Sass Davis. Sass Davis oh, is fantastic. Uh, Brian, yeah, your eyes haven't let you down this time. Sass Davis did perfectly positioned. Oh, there's a foul. Free kick, perfectly positioned. Chances are coming slowly but surely at both ends, to be fair. Oh, it's a chance. Ooh, that's oh, a wow. decent header, but always uh, going uh, wide. Billy Sass Davis, who, uh, you know, he's still only young. He's still only 20. He's got a little bit to learn. I thought he, had, I thought he was a little bit shaky in the first 15 minutes against Aldershot. Evans also coming forward. Let's not forget, he's a, a big unit. In comes the oh, cross. It goes over everybody. It comes out to Smith. And it's a great clearance. That's a phenomenal clearance oh. uh, by Josh Hancock, I think it is. How did he keep hit that the crossbar? Out? I'm not sure. Certainly, uh, it was hacked off the line and it was travelling it past Tony Thompson and towards the net at a rate of knots. It really was. It looked a goal all over. Costello's got a bit of space to attack. Looks wide. Densmore, good run from the experienced full, but decent cross as well. Adore Bayo's up there. Was that a foul? And he's done well there, Adore Bayo. Here you. And it comes to Smith. Altrincham still in possession. That's an <laughs> interesting uh, effort, but uh, a tackle that the keeper saved. He's a, he's a real unusual player, isn't he, Adara Bioyo? He's sort of he is. dense and, and, and uh, caused all sorts of mayhem, so the variation it very nearly worked. It did, and, and it, uh, Smith had plenty of space for the shot as well. Yeah, he did. Ooh, I say. Could have gone anywhere, couldn't Could have, yeah, somebody got a, a good block yeah. in there. Comes as a good one, and it's over everybody again, which Alton will uh, be happy about. That's a hell of a throw. Oh, and it's wow. just over. Again, somebody's done it's a good a job cool there. Yeah. Hampson with the throw, with the free kick rather, to uh, Hancock. Nice ball by Hancock. Finds Hampson, who's come inside. Has he shown too much? He's still got the ball. Pulls it across. Decent effort. Chance comes out. It, ooh. It's a penalty. Oh, no. That's oh, a penalty. Wow. Smith's gone over. I didn't and think. Yeah, I thought. Mm. I'm quite surprised, Brian. Um, with you. My initial reaction was penalty. Uh, whether it was going to be given or not, wasn't sure. But my I, I, I thought he was starting to go down. Yeah. Smith, before uh, any contact happened. But yeah. not that we'll be. Uh, Taking issue with Mr. James, with uh, rather Mr. Evans about that. Here comes uh, Hancock. He yes. scored. That is a really good penalty. Altrincham take the lead and have scored their first penalty of the season. Matty Costello missed one in the dying stages of the Hartlepool game, but uh, after 62 minutes. Josh Hancock has got his first goal of the season and that was nicely placed. Good for Josh Hancock because there's a lot riding on that. We've made a point of saying how much, uh, how important a win is to Altrincham, uh, open their accounts at home. And it's the game so finely balanced. It's 1-1, a, a, a lot of pressure on him, but he, he stepped up and he could not have taken that any better. Low and firmly struck into the bottom corner. Yeah, calmly done. N very, very uh, nice uh, penalty. And not a typical uh, Hancock penalty, but uh, Altrincham have got some uh, work to do here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, my goodness, what a strike that is. Jordan Cropper, Cropper. fantastic uh, finish, angled shot, and Altrincham only ahead for barely 60 seconds. It's 2-2. Two -two. Not a, not a no goalkeeper in the world uh, was, uh, was going to save that. No, well, I mean, we didn't even have time to say we need to keep it tight for a few minutes here and, and safeguard the lead before the lead's gone. And, and it was a, a tremendous strike. No doubt we will see one or two changes in the coming minutes. Nice little header from Densmore finds Coslo. Coslo's got a bit of space to attack. In he goes. Good play from Coslo, and it's a decent effort. And the save there eventually cleared. <laughs> the 
quiet. Yanni. Looking for Bowden. Good run by Bowden. Cross comes in. Is oh, oh, what a, oh, what save. a great save! <laughs> oh, great header by Denton. Great, a fine cross. Great header. Superb save by Tony Thompson. Thought he was just helping it into the goal, but glad to see it was coming out the other way. That's magnificent piece of uh, of goalkeeping. Like you, Brian, I thought, is it still going to drop in? But yeah, I thought it was on its way into the net, yeah. but really pleased to say that it was... He had that sort of look that he deserved. He did. He got a strong enough arm on it. It's, it it's a brilliant save. It really yeah. is. Yeah. And it was a great cross as well. Yes, it was. Densmore. Absolutely on a knife edge this game now. Here's Hancock. Smith. Oh, decent the right idea. decent effort right and idea. Uh, not too far away. So not played a National League game since uh, the first week of the season. Butterfield's intercepted a wayward ball there from Hampson. Uh, this is a ooh, that's a, an interesting shot and the dangers. And well, <laughs> that's it. You know what? That, that was initially you think Tony Thompson should have done better but it's a very awkward ball he had to deal with and he didn't take it cleanly and then the second bit of goalkeeper in the game was excellent that was a, such a point blank uh, block he made there to deny uh, the goal here's uh, Tom Hannigan Fielder got their shape defensively, Altrincham working the ball slowly but surely. It's a good ball. Oh, good nice dummy. little dummy. And oh, oh yes! Great goals. Oh, 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 yes, yeah. Hancock! Oh, what a lovely, lovely move! Wasn't it just? And what a clever dummy as well. Was it Kosselo? I, I think it was. I think it runs through. That's quite deliberate. So he's got eyes in the it, back of his head. Was it Kosselo? I'm not sure it was Kosselo or Smith, but it was. A, I think. I think you're right. I think it was Kosselo. Clearly, eyes in the back of his head because Josh Hancock was behind him. Yet he had the foresight and the and uh, uh, and the intelligence to let, let it run on, realizing that Josh Hancock was in a better position than him. But Hancock still had plenty to do because he had to take the ball in his stride and then get to his foot in for, to get the shot away before a a defender on his left shoulder, b the goalkeeper leaving his line, closed down the space, and he did it brilliantly. Squeezed it past the keeper for the goal. Can we hang on a little bit longer this time than we did after scoring our second goal? Yeah, let's hope so, because there's not much lo that long left. A couple of minutes uh, plus added time to go here. It's probably... Uh, uh, oh, that'll, that'll do. The football's just launched into the, into the main stand. Uh, great cheers of relief uh, from the bench. There it is. Altrium have their first home victory in the National League since Welling United was dispatched by five goals to nil.